dance, I like to dance, 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 I like to dance, dance, dance. It's an original. It's an original. Buy the original. Not done yet, not done. Oh, oh, sister, no ma'am. That ain't like her mama. That ain't like her mama, that's for sure. Will I cry? Will I leave behind? Broken and crumbled signs Hiding all my roads to you Uh-oh And if I fight Will I come to life? We're on the road Calling Heading back home Ready to get there But we've got a long drive ahead So we may do one more adventure you. Maybe Maybe uh -oh. And I've been falling, I've been lost And I've been calling on my ghosts I put it to rest because I'm coming home, coming home Dance, I like to dance, 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 dance I like to dance, dance, dance It's an original. It's an original. Buy the original. Not done yet, not done. Oh, oh, sister, no ma'am. That ain't like her mama. That ain't like her mama. That's for sure. Like your daddy. That's like her daddy for sure. <laughs> I got the moves. So we just finished eating. Right there. Right there. Was it MTN Prime? Or does that stand for Mountain Prime? I'm not really sure. Yeah. But this, you ready to go home? I am. I'm ready to be home. I'm not ready to go home. I like to be here or I like to be there. I don't like the process of... In between. Yes. So, this little town is pretty cute. What is it? Col no. Idaho Springs. Idaho Springs. It is precious. It reminds me of Natchez, Mississippi. Or Natchitoches. Or Natchitoches, yes. With mountains. So, there's all these little stores. The line the side of the road on each side. We've got the mountains in the background. And what did I miss? Chip was climbing that tree. Well, of course. Because he's a monkey. I put it to rest because I'm coming home, coming home, oh. And I've been carried, I've been dragged. And we are about 45 minutes away from the Denver airport, and we were going to go on another adventure today. Mount Evans, the, the peak, the summit is the highest point that you can get to in I think North America that highest the highest paved road so we were going to have another adventure today however after kind of looking at how long it would be to get up to the top and how long it would be to get back to the airport on time and not have any hiccups we decided to forego that mission so we are going to just go on to the airport and get there a little early maybe adventure around the airport so that's where we're heading hope we're gonna be going home soon so we've only had one bad experience during this whole trip So if there's one thing you shouldn't do on a trip, it's probably rent from advantage. You think going through security is fun? Do it with kids. Longer than the one in Alexandria. Hey, what's new? Stressful. Um, that was easier than I thought, but it just went well. Denver 
and we've been hanging out at this awesome airport and we're about to go to Houston. My favorite thing about the airplanes are the little pull-out trays. My least favorite part is that you have to sit with someone you don't even know. Isn't that crazy? We're ready. We're ready. We're going to Houston right now. Poor kids. But mom, it's, it's about listen, supper time. If parents, if parenting was the Olympics, traveling on a plane would be an entire sport, wouldn't it? It is so true. It is so true. We need rewards. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Houston local time is 8.20. We'll be taxiing for the next few minutes. Please remain seated with your seatbelt securely fastened until we reach the gate and the captain turns off the brass and seatbelt on. Harper's ears were popping and hurting the whole way down. Plus, I think she's a little tired. It's like 9.30. I don't even know what the time is. It's 8.30. And she's been up since 5.30 their time. So, let's just look. We have 30 minutes, maybe 40 minutes till we board. And I'm not sure how far we are from our gate. Whenever we went to Advantage and we stopped and got our car, um, we were, of course, hopeful that everything would go smooth, but shortly after we arrived, um, one of the, the lady that was checking us in was, was telling us that we needed to buy this um, pass for the tolls. And we assured her that we wouldn't go through any tolls, which she then told us that yes, definitely we would, and we would be charged like double if we don't buy this pass. So we went ahead and added it, whatever. Um, and then we were told that the car seat would be waiting on us. We get to the car and there's no car seat. And then they tell me that I must go get it from the shed. So I go to the shed to pick up the car seat and there's a discombobulated, thrown everywhere car seats. And I'm just like trying to decipher like what car seat is going to be safest. So it was just crazy. And then after all of that, um, there was just one thing after another and then the upsell like she kept saying you need you need the escalade you need the escalade for your family so we're like no 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 we're good we're good and she was like well look i'm just going to go ahead and give you this really really good rate and she just would not stop so we finally were like okay we'll take it we just need to leave so after all of that we were in the car and it was just like we were like, never again. By the time that they upsold us everything, we would have done better to go to Hertz or um, Enterprise or somewhere that we knew and trusted. So anyway, then we got on Yelp and we see that there's like, you know, one and a half stars rating. We will never do that again. I will check Yelp next time before we go anywhere. So those are the three reasons why we will not choose Advantage ever again. Now we're gonna catch our last flight. Everything looks good. We should be home in an hour. And bed, and here I'm I come. And I've been lost. And I've been calling on my ghost. I put it to rest because I'm coming home, coming home. Please make sure your carry-ons are fitting in the overhead. Because I'm coming home, coming home. I'm coming home. So I'm going to give you a quick tour of where we're staying in Beaver Creek. Well, welcome in. Thank you. So over here, there's this little sitting area. And in here is the first half bathroom. It's really small. There's a toilet and then a sink. And then over here, this is mom and dad's room where they sleep over here. And then over here is the big bathroom or I should say the master bathroom. And there's sinks over there, and then they have a big jacuzzi, and then a little shower, and then a toilet, and then in here there is two sinks, and then downstairs,
then towards this way, these stairs. And then, okay, so this way, there's this nice little hallway thing. And then this is me and Jet's room. There's this nice view. Over here you can see a little uh, roundabout and there's a little fountain down there. And you can also see we have two little nightstands to put our stuff. This lovely bed. And then here is our bathroom. It has a bath and a shower, a toilet, and a sink over here. And then through this way. If you look on this slide over there, it's on dining. The or you can lights. walk over there and flick up the thing underneath there. And then over here is Hudson Harbor's little nook and there's a nice chair there and a little nightstand kind of thing. And a really tiny nightstand right here and then they have their two twin beds. And then over here is the kitchen. You got your refrigerator, your freezer, and you have your little, uh, what is this called, Jet? Uh, oven. A little mini oven thing, and then your toaster, and then your knives, your and then your big version of, and then you have your oven, and then microwave, the big version. microwave, coffee machine, oh, sink, and counter space, and then over here, this is our kitchen table, and we have like a little bar kind of thing over here, and then over here is our big dining table, and then outside there's a beautiful view. And then back inside the house, there's our little living room kind of lounge. Just finishing up watching Paw Patrol. So, you guys, you guys tell one thing, your favorite thing, or maybe your two favorite things. Go, Jet, what's your two favorite things? Uh, this whole trip. This whole trip. Mm, probably the um, the the digging for gym painting. Okay, yeah. Or that. digging. And what's your second favorite? Second favorite airplanes. You like that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. And also the buses. Time. My I have, my two favorites are probably the gym painting mm -hmm. and just getting out here and getting to explore. But if if we got to go to first class, that would have been my Okay, Harper favorite. Jean, what did, what, what did you enjoy while we were here? Say it out loud. Going ice skating. Ice skating, I forgot no. that. Going ice skating. And gym panning. Ice skating and gym panning. And Hudson, what is your favorite? Gym panning and ice skating. Really? And, and plus going swimming and the, and the airplane. Okay, and my favorite thing was probably having a home to come to every night and the ATV trail hiking. That was like my, that my best. So, it's time to go. Let's go. Bye, you guys. We're going on the airplane.